June 9, 2023, officers were called when a woman attempted to use another woman's ID to purchase a laptop from Best Buy. She kind of straight too. Now I never, when I worked at Best Buy, I wasn't in loss prevention. I was over selling computers. Technically, well, back when I used to work there, Yellow was loss prevention and managers. I was a blue shirter, but I sold computers and laptops. Yeah, they think you're using fraudulent identification. My wife don't. I don't have no idea. On them. Oh, thank you. Yeah, can we just move out of the yeah, way? Let's so we can Yeah, I would have sold the laptop, but see, Best Buy is different from other places. Best Buy is no commission. You get hourly. So all I do is I'll I'll get the laptop. I'll take the laptop out and I'll walk it up to the front. But then I'll go back. So when you buy laptops, you got to buy the laptops over at the customer service. You can't go up to the regular registers. Any like big purchases like that, you go over to the customer service and buy it. Because most of the time they either got to get it out the cage or I got to go over there and get the manager with the key to the cage. So I wouldn't have been the one that actually sold it to her. I would have just been telling her, hey, this is the, the specs. No. Looks like you. That's not me. That looks like you. That is not. That does not look like me. No, it looks like you. Yeah. White SUV. All right. What was she Heading trying to purchase? Uh, um, computer. Computer. I'm not going nowhere. I'm trying to move from the side. Yeah, you could move over here. Okay. You're not even the officer. Right. Right. I'm not talking to you. What's she trying to get? Uh, computer. 1300 bucks. Mac? 1300 bucks. Uh, Windows this time. Windows? Yeah. The two other guys that came with her. Uh, I didn't come with that guy. Was asking me for my number actually, yeah. and I was trying to move. Yeah, I don't know. I, him. I'm not talking to you. So you the said two really, other guys. What the camera? There was one guy up, there following, the asking for my number. Yeah. 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 What's going on? I would have ran. I was saying that I was doing fraud with another guy, but I walked in, right? I'm sorry, the sun is in my here, face. Let me, let's, uh, here, yeah. let's go over this way just um, so we don't get the sun in your eyes. While I was waiting for him, some guy came behind me. He was asking me for my social media and my number, and I'm like, uh, no, I have a boyfriend. Like, leave me alone. And he thinks I was with the guy doing fraud. Okay, all right. Uh, so you had the credit card. Yeah, I was looking at um the laptops, and I had asked him for uh, a laptop, but that was about it. I didn't purchase nothing i don't have nothing okay did you try to open a credit card no i didn't you did not no, he gave i asked for the information he gave me all the information okay. hey so you're a sick individual like, no. here's my credentials <laughs> no. that is for female uh, no this i was gonna crazy. try to purchase um a laptop depending on the price of it sure and he just said okay he got the laptop went back there and never came back okay and then what, when he came back um he has is a surface pro water and another yeah oh, so you're trying to get the microsoft uh, service for right, the nfl package okay every month this airbnb so it seems like she came in with the guy and he told her which uh what product to buy he's probably the one that's getting the fake credit card numbers or he probably stole the credit card but that's what it sounds like and old boy got low because he ain't had nothing to do with it now nah, she ain't innocent Girl, guilty okay. and then barring whatever guilty like I said, we just got here, so I'm just trying yeah. to figure out what's going on. So, okay. um, what time did you get here? Do you know about? Like, um, I don't know. 30, 40 minutes ago? 10, 20 minutes ago? It's uh, 6.55 now. Um, not even, know. maybe 10 minutes. 10 minutes? Yeah. What's your last name? Um, How do I spell that? I mean, they could let us hear her last name. Jeanette. J-A-N-E-T-T-E. Jeanette. -T -T -E. Yes. Do you have a middle initial, Jeanette? No. Um, I don't, I don't know, because I'm here for vacation. Oh, um, I bet. Where are you from? I'm from New York, oh, okay. originally, yeah. Um, can I answer, because I had um, left the Uber, and I didn't even, 
I had like two edges so he could take me back. You were the Uber? Yeah, but he left. So okay. Yeah, I just let him know it's gonna be a minute. All right. Yeah, just one. order another one. Just stay over here though. Okay. Jeanette, no middle initial. No, we don't know her last name. She from New York. I believe she's in on the scam. She just got Hello. called up. No, ya te jodí. Deme, deme llamar el Uber driver. Can you run a name to you, please? Because the Uber was calling me before he left. So you walked in trying to buy a laptop. I was asking for the price, okay. right? And So they, they came up to you. You're like, you're interested oh. in this laptop, the employee? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They went to the I back. Them, they never came back. Yeah, he went to the back. And then and you went up to the line. What line? No, I was there the whole time. Oh, where? The register. Right over here? Yeah. Okay. And See, I told you, you can't buy high price items over at the register. You got to go over to customer service. Boy, they need a hey, best buy. Hire your boy. I know all the procedures still. Um, I was asking where did he go um, to the other employees, and he said he was trying to get something from a printer to work or something like that. And then when he came back, uh, I was about to walk out. And then right yeah, before I, I was about to walk out, he ran behind me. And the officer came in. Okay. What about these guys? You said there were some I, guys. No, they, they could check the camera. There was a guy. I'm standing in one of these aisles, and a guy came behind me asking me for my Instagram and cell phone number. It was a dark-skinned guy, and I told him, no, I don't have. He's like, so you don't have social media? I'm like, no, I have a boyfriend. You said it was a dark-skinned guy? Yeah, he had, like, braids. Oh, like dreads? Yeah, dreads whatever. or braids. I don't know. And a hat. Did he have anything um, else, like tattoos? Could no, I didn't notice. What was he wearing? I swear, I, I wasn't even trying to look at him because I didn't want no eye contact on him, but he was like literally right behind she me. She struck him. I was the, oh, right where the TV is curved. That's where, where I was standing and he came behind me asking me for my information. Do you have an ID on you? Uh, no, I don't. You don't? Okay. Okay, sounds good. Take your time. All right, we'll wait here and then my partner will come talk to you and then we'll okay. get going from there. See? Now she was better off saying, hey, this guy may have stole my card or switched my card or something. Because now you're making it seem like it was only you. They, they're not getting you for stealing anything. They're getting you for a credit card, someone else's credit card. Now, she must have either put like the wrong pin in. I want to know how they found out it wasn't her credit card. Because, I mean, just not having an ID. They usually don't even check the ID for real. But you're saying you don't know this guy at all. At all. Okay. I don't know, like if they check the camera, you could, well, I mean, I don't know if they could hear at least. Sure. If they could hear him asking me for my number. But you're saying my you kind of brushed media. him off, right? Yeah, I, I tried not, I turned around and I'm like, oh no. He said, before you go back to the guy, because he was helping me, then he left and he was like, before you go to the other guy, can I have your phone number or your social media? And I said, no, that I didn't have, that I didn't have social media. And I couldn't give him my number. Okay. But I don't know him at all. Okay. How'd you get here today? In an Uber. 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 Are you staying low, like in a hotel in the local area? Or? Yeah, well, I already checked out the hotel. Where were you staying? And, um... Uh -oh. It was the, um... Uh, I check Just check your Uber. It'll tell you where you got picked up from, and then we can trace it from there. We can trace the address from there. Or you can bring up a confirmation of your hotel, and we can just verify some of this information. It ain't that hard. What y'all think? She innocent? It's just a misunderstanding? Sorry, miss. Did you say no record in both? Yeah, no record in New York and Illinois. Okay. No. Are you out of New York? If I'm out of New Like, do you live in New York? Yes, I That's do. where your driver's license is at. Yeah. Your government ID. Yes, I'm New York. My birthday, yes. Okay, because we're not getting anything back on there, which means that you don't I exist. Never check, I've never been arrested. How do I exist? No, I'm talking about, like, your driver's license. Oh, um, So yes. that means... No, you're... yes, yes. I've never been arrested. No. <laughs> you ain't got to be arrested to bring up your damn driver's license. I for fighting and stuff like that. No, that's, that's nonsense. Yeah. How long you live in New York? Oh, my life. Out of uh, New York. I want to get to the scam, man. I don't care about nothing. Live. I want to see how this is doing. How it's just making it happen. Okay, thank you. All right, like I said, we'll wait for him to come over and then see what's going on here. 
or th- I don't know if I missed it. It is in Illinois. Illinois. I just check out, so I'm not gonna lie. I come here and work like at the strip clubs and stuff okay. like that. Oh. I I like. Now we're getting somewhere. We got us a stripper. I was like, damn, she got a little body on her. You know, if I had some money, you know, I'm not, I'm not really one to indulge in the strip club. I go there to get some wings or something, a little drink, a little social event. But oh, she's a stripper. Hmm. Maybe one of those gentlemen were a pimp. Hmm. But she ain't never been arrested. She don't know where she was staying at. She's from New York. It looks like she has someone else's credit card. But if she if she a real deal stripper and she here to work, she should have cash on her. I ain't never known a strip club to give you a check. There ain't no direct deposits. Sometimes in different states, or, okay. you know. But were you staying in the city or were you staying on a suburb? What here? Yeah, like were you staying in Chicago or were you staying yeah, in yeah. Chicago? Like I, and then I just go like every time I work at a club, I go to a, to a next club the next day and stay at a near hotel from there or Airbnbs and stuff like that. Okay. All right. So do you come for like extended like a couple no. of weeks or just a couple of days? Or? No, this is my first time here in Chicago. For okay. That. This is your first time in Chicago, but just a minute ago, you told us you always come here and you be working. Which one is it, Jeanette? All right. I pray and it has found, like, sure. seriously. Yeah, I, I don't know if they have, like, audio. Yeah. I don't know how the cameras work here, to be honest. Well, I hope it, they do, so he, just, at least just so he could feel stupid, because I I would understand, but we definitely didn't look like we was together. Sure. But maybe because he saw him with his phone in his hand trying to talk to me, maybe he could yeah you know how it goes when you're watching something from kind of a distance you can't really tell what's going on yeah fuck it guilty when are you heading back to new york i was just trying to make money to pay my freaking bills and then i didn't even have like flight or anything to leave yet no shit they're going through a hard time and I have kids and bills and how many kids? Two. Two. Yeah, you came to Chicago to get money? You couldn't go to Jersey or Carolina's in Chicago? Huh? This is Jeanette. Hey Jeanette, what what brought you in today? So I just came out here like I was selling my dance at strip clubs and then from city to city. And then I came in. I'm not gonna lie, I was Trying to get a laptop, but I didn't even purchase anything. I didn't. I didn't get anything. Okay. Well, did you give him anything up there? The ID. You gave him the ID. Yeah. And it's not you. Wait. So she doesn't have. I thought she had a credit card, but she had an ID that wasn't her. Oh, so that's why when he said this looks like you, she said it wasn't her. So she had a fake ID. She probably had a fake ID. Well, not a fake ID. She probably had a stolen ID with the stolen credit card. And she said it don't look alike. So, oh, that's how they got her. The scamming stripper. Really? It's not me. It's someone that looks like me. Though. Okay. What we're going to do is we have to place you under arrest for possession of fraudulent ID. So if you put your hands behind your back. Okay. And I left my bag in the Uber, so I, I don't know. Okay. I, I'm sure one of our... Can I text her. my mom and let her know? Oh, we'll, let you, we'll let you call at the police department, okay? okay. What, well, she got a roly on? Or that a poly? I think they still would have caught her up because they would have asked her her birthday. They would have asked her her address. This is too tight on this side. Uh, it's over with. She wasn't going to make it out of here. If the Best Buy employees can pick up on that that easily, you know the police are going to get on her ass. Oh this is what I was talking about. How many people do you really think can outsmart the police? If the Best Buy employees caught your ass with a fake ID, you think the police ain't going to be able to figure that out when they can call the shit in? She talking about, well, I've never been arrested. My ID won't pop up. Your name, your birthday, and where you're from, it's going to pop up regardless if you've been arrested or not. Damn. They didn't got the stripper, man. We didn't lost a good woman, man. Fuck the police. What up, Kendall? I'll grab your bag. I got your bag. Let go of your bag. Yeah. We're gonna walk outside.
Damn, she's thick too. Run, 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 run. If I was an employee, I'd be like, come back later. We hope to see you again. Is your mom living in Illinois? No, you currently live in Illinois? Okay. How long have you been in Illinois for? Two days. Two days. Do you have any pockets on you or anything or no? No pockets. No, no, she ain't got you. You think she can put pockets on that? Looking at them, 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 them thighs and that little thing? Can't have no damn pockets on them damn things right there. You don't even need to pat her down. You know ain't nothing on that. Wait, what's the thing there? Yeah, yeah, yeah it's, it's just, just gonna go. Yeah, it's just gonna go across. Oh my god! Damn, all in the whole fleet. She was charged with identity theft. Do you think she was persuaded by someone else to try and make this purchase using someone else's ID? Let us know in the comment section below and don't forget to like and subscribe. Damn. Well, so what it looks like is whatever guy that was in there trying to get at her, he probably handed off the ID and shit like, hey, get this laptop. Boom, here's the ID, here's the credit card. And then he went on about his business because he figured they wouldn't be able to spot you know, saying the ID is not looking too much like her, but Best Buy caught her ass. So we'll get back to the young thugger trial. Long story short, she said, Oh boy, was trying to holler at her. Fellas, that is your sign to never be afraid to shoot your shot. Because sometimes when you shoot your shot, you don't even know what they're going on, what they got going on in their lives. You may shoot your shot this whole time. She's a scamming ass bum. She's over here with fake IDs trying to steal shit. So this whole time you thought that never trust a big button to smile. This motherfucker is poison. She's a scam artist, but never be afraid to shoot your shot. Just because they look good don't mean that they're living good. She's a bum and they arrested her. Let's get back to this trial. <laughs> 